safe flower for Colorado is a columbine, which incidentally grows really easily here. So today we're looking at my columbine. My columbine is doing amazingly well. It's been in the ground here for, I wanna say two years, at least two years. Well, you are supposed to deadhead these, but I really want to collect some seeds, so I might not. If you deadhead them, you can extend their flowering season from like six to eight weeks. But I I really want some more seeds. I don't know. We're, we're going to see. The new ones are coming out too. These bloom from spring to like kind of early summer here in Colorado. usually find them in the mountains. They don't grow on the plains, so I have them under some shade. There are like 70 different types of columbines, um, all different colors. If you've seen, there's yellow and pink and almost red, all different shades of purple. There's one, I really want the one with the white center. Like these just have a purple center, but I'd love to get the ones with the white center and the purple outside. Those are the ones that grow wild up in the mountains here. But they're so pretty and they're doing so good this year. This is the first year that they've been like really crazy blooming. Which is cool because it's been such a weird year that nothing else is doing anything. What's that? Tell them what that is. An uh, ice plant. Keep it weird. Keep it weird. Keep it weird. <laughs> Keep it weird. 